I'm Ryan Braun. We're here at Oshkosh 2021 uh, I'm with UAVionics, uh, Chief Operating Officer, and we're here uh, this year introducing our new product, the AV30. And we have both experimental and certified versions of this unit. Uh, for Kit Plane's audience, the AV30E is the product that you'll be looking for. And we have a lot of new features that we're rolling into this. Uh, if you were here two years ago, you probably saw the beginning of this product uh, in the intervening year and a half or so that we've been working on it. We've added a lot of new features. And uh, we're showing that here today uh, in this unit. And uh, we've done some footage to show you some of our new features. One of those is traffic functionality. Uh, it's really important uh, that we, as an ADSB company, can see the traffic around us. And it was one of the first things we wanted to add to the unit. So the base unit provides directional gyro and attitude indicator functionality. Uh, it replaces a traditional three inch round instrument in your panel. Uh, typical installations normally have two of them. If you have a vacuum system and you replace both your attitude indicator and directional gyro, uh, that allows you to remove the vacuum system and save considerable weight on your aircraft. Uh, but we wanted to take that a step further and really add some innovative feature. So this is the AV link. Uh, it's a wireless adapter uh, that goes in between your AV30 and your existing wiring harness. So it's a very quick, easy installation. Uh, you just plug this end in and plug in your existing harness. Uh, it passes all of the signals through, but it adds wireless functionality to your AV30. That wireless functionality uh, enables traffic to come from a portable ADSB receiver like a Sentry or a Stratix. It also allows the information from your AV30 to go back out to your EFB software. So we're working with vendors to be able to bring the air data, like your uh, pressure, your altitude, your airspeed, your angle of attack, and of course your certified AHARS data back into the electronic flight bag. So we think this is a really key piece of the connected cockpit and it's gonna allow that integration uh, between your, your panel instruments uh, and the EFB that you have on your lap. So AV-Link is the, the start of the features that we're adding here. Uh, we're working on a number of integrations uh, as we see uh, people wanting more features and capabilities on what's really a, a small multifunction display. Uh, one of the things that people are asking for above all else is autopilot integration. Uh, we're announcing our first autopilot integration uh, here at AirVenture, and that's with the, the TrueTrack uh, line of autopilots. And that enables heading bug, altitude pre-select, and uh, SVS, or vertical speed control, uh, from the unit, uh, which is a very slick, very smooth integration. Uh, we're also working on autopilot adaptation with other makers, uh, both digital and analog autopilots. What that will eventually enable uh, is uh, the display of your horizontal and vertical guidance as well. Currently, we offer the ability to display uh, an HSI or CDI for VFR operations, but once we complete these autopilot integrations, we'll also offer uh, the ability to pair to your IFR navigator uh, and display the full guidance information. So the AV30 is available now. Uh, we're, we're taking order slots for them. Uh, the AV30E, the experimental version, is available for $15.95. The certified version is $19.95. Uh, the AV link is also available now for experimental marketplace at $299. We are working on the certification for this product as well uh, for those of you in the certified space. And we're here in Hangar C at AirVenture, booth 3081. We look forward to meeting you and hearing about your airplane.